All right. In three, two. We're back. And I'm not happy. Hold on. Let me just speak to the audience for two seconds. I know you guys watch our show and you think it's very silly, but today we are talking about something, well, serious to him. And obviously he's not happy about it. I'm definitely not happy. Proceed. We're here to talk about the most derided for me, my most derided. Is this correct? What? Your backdrop. Yes, it's correct. Because you were a bit too, a bit, bit too quick, Abu Jamie. Abu Jamie, we've kept but, you on for one more thing and you've already fucked it up within the first 10 seconds I'm, of our show. I'm, anyway, continue. I'm here to talk about the severance packages that um, highly paid football managers receive and have been receiving now for the last 20 years. Economy draining, insulting um and not only what? that not only that what? not only that it actually it actually reinforces the the myth that it pays to fail in fact football managers now are making more money making more money for getting fired than they are for being hired and performing well which is the biggest joke in the history of economic theory. Can I ask you a question? Okay, and I'm just going to say, just, I'm just, just putting Terry Venables up first. Hold on, can I just ask yes, you a question? You may, you may. Number one, who cares about this? I do. I do. Because we're all hardworking people working in a very competitive industry environment. And so okay, what's your gripe here? That these show puppets, okay, who are labeled as geniuses by the media, okay, and by fans who have been hoodwink, hoodwinked into thinking that they present some sort of special mysticism, some sort of like hidden genius, are doing a job actually that the common man, that me and you even, okay, with no training could do, and we would achieve the same results. And I actually think I have the data to support it. Okay, but like, okay, fine. So no, it's not fine. No, 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 it's not fine. You shouldn't be I, rewarded I, 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 for failure on a consistent, continuous basis. Do you okay, have, Abu Jamie, can you get him okay. some Valium, please? Yeah. Number one. Number I don't two. Need Valium. I'm like, I'm perfectly, I'm perfectly. Okay, can I just say one thing? Well adjusted. So yes. your big issue here is that they get paid too much. They get paid too much and they get paid even more when they don't perform and when they fail. And, this, okay? and that's our, that's the subject of our That's exactly episode. right, yes. This should be okay? fine. This should be fine. Uh, Go okay. on. Now, Mourinho is obviously the most Wait, what happened to this other guy before? Who? Venables. Yeah. He passed away recently. What? Yeah, he was up on the screen. Yeah, I know. You can go back to Venables, okay? What were you going to say about him? Uh, okay, this, is, this was the manager of the England team. Ya Allah, Abu Jamie! I have to speak to him in At a Bedouin. time when I used to like love football, okay? But this is a man who actually never took the job that seriously. And I respect him for that, okay? He always kind of took it with like, you know, a grain of salt, you know? A bit of a cheeky wink and a smile, okay? okay. Well, no, I'm just saying he's, he's my... Um, okay, he's, so he didn't get paid a lot. He didn't get paid the that much. The one you like didn't get paid. He didn't get paid that much. That's but he, great. Because he was actually working and operating in an era okay. when they weren't actually, you know, printing money. Sorry. Right, where are you going? Yeah, okay, go on. Yeah. Okay. Oh, so, Jamie, can you take care of the other... <laughs> the heater? I'll do that. Anyway... Jose Mourinho. Yeah, okay. legend. The most charismatic of managers, no question. Box office gold. Knew how to work the touchline. Knew how, ju how to gesticulate well. Okay, knew okay. how to dress well. Can I, can I just... Okay, at a time when social media started booming. And by the way, okay, it's not necessarily his fault. He's been paid over a hundred exactly. million exactly. pounds. A hundred million pounds. That's in their contract. In how is it his fault? Well, okay, let me ask you a question. Oh, so you're saying? Why... Oh, hold on, hold on. let me pose this question to you. Yeah. So you're saying you're a football manager. Yeah. Your contract says, oh, if you get fired, you get a hundred million euro payout. Yeah. You're not going to accept it. Of course you'd accept it. Exactly. So the, what, I, what are you talking about? My, my gripe is not necessarily with them accepting the, the payout. Of course they should accept it. Who wouldn't? My gripe is with people thinking that it's justified and for nobody putting a stop, putting the caboose, okay, on this, in my opinion, okay, economy draining sham of a job. Okay. Okay. How can... I mean, I can accept for one person to get, to get a golden parachute payment once. For example, let's say you work in an industry for right, 20 years. Can I just finish? You work in an industry for 20, 25 years, at the end of which you're not performing, you get a big payout, for example, no problem. But the fact that the same managers keep getting these jobs over and over and over again, that they keep getting fired before their contract elapses, which should tell the owners, by the way, why are you still giving these contracts Whatever, keep man. Firing them? whatever man, it's, and, just, it's their and, money. Let them do whatever they want with it. There has proven to be no correlation 
okay, no correlation or connection whatsoever with a manager's reputation and experience and that same manager's ability to achieve results uh, in a given excuse team. Excuse me, Go on. is Mourinho not the most successful manager out there? What do you know? He's, he's won the successful. most trophies excuse in the most countries. You didn't listen to what I he's, said. The only, there's only been one team that he hasn't won a trophy with and they fired him the day before the final. So, you know what? The reason they pay him a lot of money is because he produces results. Okay, well, let me ask you a question, okay? Let me ask Can you. we move on to the next slide? I'm bored of this already. This is, Okay. Jerry Henry. Oh yeah, okay. Now this is a great one. Okay. T -t Jerry Henry in his first management job in his first management job earned can you read that please? Twenty five point five million for euros for, a, for, for three months in Good charge. For him. Three months in charge Good of Monaco. For him. He's never managed before. He was hired based on his looks and his footballing ability, which based has on his again looks? What yes. What world do you live in? He looks he, he he's he dresses very well. He oh, resonates so that's well. Why he got hired. Absolutely. That he was a legendary Absolute, footballer. Absolutely. No, no. Oh, okay. there, there is a combination of the oh, two. Okay. And I've made the, and I will make this point oh, even okay. more resoundingly as the slides as the slides go on. At least okay? you're not taking it too seriously. I'm Can taking we it very, very seriously. Yeah, the, the, this, yeah, is very appealing. this is very This is very appealing to the audience. Move on. <laughs> Another one, Ole, right? I mean, listen, I mean yes, listen, okay. hold on, hold on. You're on three hundred These are ex football players. So what? With a legendary status. Okay, that get hired for certain jobs. We've seen it for years. In what, in what other industry? In, in plenty of other industries. Go on, to explain to me, explain to me. Any other industry where like, you think to yourself, oh, you know what, he was a great yes, footballer. Yes, so he must yes, be a great manager. yes, yes. Oh, really? Yeah. Acting. His father was a great actor, so he must be a great actor, or she must be a great actor. What? Have, no, you ask me for example, I've given you one. I've what, given you one. What percentage of... of oh, of, now percentages. Yes, of oh, course. So first it was giving an example, now give me the percentage of the example. You want an example, I'll give you one, I'll give you another 10. Go on, give me another 10. Formula One, Jacques for, Villeneuve yes. and his son. Yeah, what about him? His freaking dad was a Damon Hill and his father. But that's not, that's not the point I'm making. My point is these guys have inroads into those interests we don't, because of their fathers. They opened the door, the children followed. You're asking a question. I'm not, disp I'm not debating the They were the amazing method. in one thing and then they get allowed to do something else. Okay, well, I'm, I'm sure Monica are very happy. To be fair, that was an awful argument by the way. <laughs> but... I'm, I'm sure. I'm sure Monaco are very, very happy with the 25 million pound check they paid out. Nobody three cares. Nobody cares. Right. Well, apparently. Nobody cares. Well, well, they might be going to receivership soon. So, well, and, and well done, Monaco. Well okay, done, yes, Monaco. Why, is that, that, why does that next? Why does that like? Uh, Ole, well, go back to Ole, please. No, let's not go, go back, back to Ole. Oh, why listen, that, this is a great one. Why does that this, bother you so much? Because you know how hard it is to earn like money for like a no, like. No. A, Justifiably, so, okay, so justifiably, okay, okay, for like for for, so for services minute. rendered, okay, okay, fine, fine. not unrendered. Okay, okay, so wait, so wait, so you believe in helping the poor and the downtrodden and the common man, right? I mean, I do to an extent. Okay, that's why you vote conservative. <laughs> Very good. Okay, Lippy, I love this one. Okay, China boss, twenty-eight million to coach the China team. Speaks no Mandarin. Oh, okay. Why would you hire an Italian? Okay, who speaks no Mandarin to coach the Chinese national team paying 20 million. And by the way, do, 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 can, I, can I just make the point? Okay, oh, no. he actually performed worse than his predecessors who had no reputations whatsoever, okay, and were from uh, the native uh, country. So it just proves the point that him with all his like outstanding like Borelli shirts and, and Xenia suits and, and all that, and that incredible Paul Newman looking yeah, like, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, like yeah, Monica. Yeah, the looks, yeah, yeah, the looks, looks, the looks. Yeah, that's yeah, yeah. what they're no, hiring okay, him. Okay, Henri, 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 Henri with, fine, with, fine. with his looks. So, so, and so wait, his had, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. What, what had Lippy won before he went to China? In many things. Okay. So, yeah. but they hired him for his looks. Okay. Yes, yes, they did. Move on to they the next. Did, they okay. did. Not they for did. the, not for the like, you know, the, oh, another one. Benitez, past experience. Benitez, who oh, also no. won a lot of. Oh, they hired him yeah. for his yeah, looks. Yeah. No, 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 no. They didn't. They didn't. Oh, no, they didn't. No, 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 they didn't. No, with him, <laughs> with him, but they, they hired him because they're like, oh, Spanish genius. You know, he's part of the Spanish Armada at Liverpool and the Spanish Inquisition at Chelsea. Remember all those great headlines, right? Yeah, they hired him. Hold on. He takes over Dalian in China. Hold on. I want to just finish. Hold on. Hold on. Don't tell me none of these managers are getting hired because they haven't achieved something previously. Yeah, but it doesn't make any difference is the point I'm making. People get hired on their past experience and their past okay. achievements in any industry. Okay, fine. I'm, I'm going to go along with that, okay? But why, do they, why does the same mistake getting made over and over again? Because it's just... As in, as in, as in like Benitez, okay? Benitez, okay? He gets hired by Dalian in China, okay? 12 million a year. By the way, more than he ever earned in any of the European leagues. So in the Mickey Mouse League, he's getting paid more, okay? Left them bottom of China, yeah? Oh, and by the way, do you know how many 
Do you know how many? Hold on, do you hold know how many on. English? No, you don't, you don't, I, I just want to make the point. Do you know, do you know how many English or Spanish speaking? Because those are the two languages Benita speaks. Were in that Dalian team. I, I counted two. So the rest of the team is you know speaking what? Mandarin. You're very short sighted. Oh yeah. Right. You're very short sighted. Well, I'm sure Dalian were very happy with that. You, you don't, Twenty-five million you don't pounds. See the bigger pic- they write you out. don't see the bigger picture. Right. Here. Which is what? It's not about Dalian finishing first so, or last. It's or a, it's the prof- the profile it's the exposure of the, of the league. Okay. Well, they bring in high profile people. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. To grant more exposure to their league. Okay, so it's not so about. So now the, look at you. You're talking about not the about Chinese, the expertise. You're talking about the Chinese league. Yes. Because of these people. Hold on, hold on. So it's not about their expertise then. It's just about like. Well, oh, he's a name. Well, we'll he, bring it him helps. in. It helps. Well, it, that, it how, helps. Does it help? How's the Chinese league doing? Listen. No, no. I just want to know how it's doing. That's irrelevant. Well, it's not that's irrelevant. irrelevant. Uh, is the Next chi- how's the Saudi league doing? Because they have Gerard now earning thirty million. Yeah. Stop banging the table. Next. Great. Technical difficulties again. Okay, here I love same, this. Same I, jokes, I, man. I, 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 you I, should be look. Read this. After analyzing fifty years of league data, Nobody we found cares, that an overachieving manager's here? odds. Why are you just run to the of camera? Sustaining Why a job sitting here? is barely better than a coin flip. A coin flip. You know what that means? That means that basically, yes, whether you hire flip. Yes, yes, I understand that means that means. whether you hire whether you hire Daf Yaf Abu Jamie Did I or Mourinho. Okay. <laughs> Did I literally the same. say, let's not use our freaking names in the podcast? Did Next. Next. Christ. <laughs> okay, this is a very, very important slide. Okay, this shows you and highlights exactly what I've been saying. This is what the managers, this is how they were hired in yesteryear. You know, based on the, you know, like lack of telegenics, you know, comb over with Ratkinson, Cluffy. I'm going you know, you to fix the set. So you're just going <laughs> to... Gonna let it be. I don't know if that's Paisley or uh, Shankly and Kendall. Let right? me know when he's uh, finished. And now look at look at that. Look at that. Yeah, uh, look at those, those one. strong optics. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, you think that has nothing to do with it? They're not hiring people based on. Are we back to Benitez? Oh my God. Why? Why do you care about this, Abu Jamie? Do you care about this? No. Does anybody care about this? You think? Yes. Yes. I'm sure the paymasters care. By the way, why is this slide relevant? Yeah, the paymasters. Why is this slide relevant? Do you know why? Why? Because Everton, okay, after years of hiring sort of middle to lower tier managers for their reputation, okay, and finishing still in the premiership, then in succession hired Benitez and Ancelotti, two managers who were like at the top of their game. They actually nabbed them and they paid them extortion salaries. The cumulative finishes of Everton over that three-year period were worse than they had been in the pre- preceding 25 years. And that's with, their three, that's with their two most high-profile Champions League winning managers. Again, underlying the fact that the reputation and the experience had nothing to do with the results. Next, Abu Jamie. What's okay, this another, now? Another, oh, another no. insult. Oh, okay. An insult. I didn't, the I, didn't, I didn't know we were going to be sitting on a freaking lecture. 878,000 pounds. Okay, the manager makes more than his entire staff combined. Now, I'm sure you think that's very justifiable, okay? But can I just ask you something? Tell me. Do you think if you were the head of, like, for example, like you were the manager of an advertising agency yes. or a marketing company, do you think your salary would be more than all your employees combined? And answer that honestly. A media company, not the owner. You're the manager. Well, you hey, well, more on. than all the it employees dep- combined? It depends how many employees I have, number one. Well, okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So you're going to earn more yourself. Then all of them combined. Yeah, that's not cool. That's not cool. <laughs> Thank you. For once we agree. <laughs> Jamie, go on. Ah, now we're talking. Sorry. It's the just man, the myth, the legend. I the love man, him. The man was earned, the man was earned 100 him. million. Respect. I respect. respect. The man who just earned 100 freaking impersonations, by the way, this episode. I know you love Maurizio, but you know you need to be motherfucker. There you so go. I should not say that for YouTube, but you know, I know. I know. You look in my eyes, okay? <laughs> I know. You play like this. You cross. Yeah. Come, come. Respect, respect. <laughs> 150 million or, so, or thereabouts in that, in that region for, for, uh, for getting fired. But that's all right, right? Okay. And then, you but know, wait, do you know what he said now? You know what? You know what? You've got this huge issue. You've got this massive problem with these. What's your solution? My solution? Stop paying them fees for services unrendered. If, if somebody can just figure out, and they've already figured it out, by the way, okay? Like I'm firing a manager every 1.3 years, okay? That's the actually average rate of a manager's, uh, 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 what do you call it, tenure, okay? They all get hired for three, four year contracts. Now, if you're, if you're the, the head of a company or the head of a firm or head of a football club, yeah? And you know, my God, no one I hire is outlasting their contract. There's something wrong with the recruitment model. If nobody can outlast their, or I'm not saying nobody, obviously, but 90% of, of, of hirings get fired before they finish. 
Why don't you change the contract? Why don't you say, listen, I'm going to give you a, a job one year at a time. By the way, like every, like every company does. By the way, when you get fired, you get some gardening leave, three months or something like that. Not five years of pay. Like Graham Potter, right? He got hired, right? He got like a 50 million pound payoff or thereabouts. Okay. It was Graham Potter so much in demand that he would not have turned down something for one fifth that money? For one fifth that money? No, he wouldn't. Oh, look at that. <laughs> That's a thing of beauty. Listen. Very handsome. He just got fired. Very smart. Exactly. Did you say that? Yes, I did. I stopped listening a long yeah. time ago. Anyway, thank you so much for another great episode. <laughs> He's Don't gonna... pay football managers. Don't pay them. Listen to me. Please see a therapist. Uh, like comment, subscribe, and uh, we'll see you again. Big grudgingly. <laughs> <laughs>